I even feel corny saying it because it's not my style. But, dude, you really can go out and learn the skills to be whatever it is you want to be. You could either pity and cry and whine about it and be sad and say, poor me. Or you can say, like we said, what, what can I learn from this? What's good about this? And how can I use this? Hi, my name is Andy Hudson. I am 28 years old. I am 5'11 and I weigh 240 pounds. That is the beginning of my transformation right now. Um, I would say I've lost two pounds in the past week just by, you know, following the diet, you know, going to the gym and doing all that. But 240 pounds is where I'm starting. I'm glad that my transformation, starstoday.com, came out. It's something that could not be a better tool. I mean, it, honestly, I, I don't know where else you could get all this information for free and get a trainer for free with advice, tips, and you know, the, ed, the group of people involved in this, all the motivation and all that. I don't know where you can get anything else like that. So thank you for putting that up. My transformation for me is both a mental and physical transformation. Obviously, physically, 240 pounds at 5'11 isn't a healthy weight to be at. And that has effect on me mentally. My, you know, where my head at isn't where it should be. It's not who I want to be. It's not what I want to do. Um, being at 240 pounds at 5'11, I don't feel comfortable in my own skin. It's, you know, clothes fit tight. You know, you're wearing an extra large 2X, you know, size 36. Waistband, I mean, it shouldn't be that way for me. I don't think it should. And there's no reason why I shouldn't be healthier, living a better lifestyle. And that's what this transformation physically is gonna do for me, is lose weight. But it's also mentally gonna get me back to my social side. You know, I like people, you know, obviously some people I always try to put out there, oh, I hate people, I hate people. But, you know, truly, honestly, there are good people out there. And sitting inside, feeling sorry for yourself, isn't something that, you know, good people should do. I believe I'm a good person at heart. I have the ability to talk to people. You know, I like meeting with people. I like helping people. I like pushing people. But what's holding me back is my weight and my size. I mean, honestly that's you know hindering me from doing something greater than what I'm doing right now you know I want to give a better life for my fiance give a better life for my mom and dad I want to give a better life for my fiance's parents you know anybody that I come in contact my friends you know I want them to look at me and go shit you know if he can do it I can do it too I know it's cliche to say but it's truly what I feel like I think that, you know, losing the weight and helping people along the way, you know, creates that bond that, you know, you can't take that back. You've both gone through some really, really hard times together. And coming together as a family, losing weight, supporting each other, that's what this whole transition's about. It's, you know, it's a lifestyle. It's not, you know, a one-time thing. It was, at one point for me, just a one-time thing. I had been 150 pounds, blew up to 200 pounds, lifting weights, um, and then let that fall to the wayside. And then 40 pounds has crept up on me over the past five years. And I don't, you know, physically see it, but as, you know, I go back to real pictures, you know, I'm seeing that, you know, damn, you know, you're big now. You know, that's not a good look for you. And that look, you know, 240 pounds looking in the mirror and your waist is hanging over the edges, you know, it's just, it doesn't feel good. Um, so this transformation for me is something more than just a physical transformation. I mean, it's also a transformation for me to get back out, um, talk, meet with people, you know, hang out with people, socialize, make new friends. I mean, not sure with First Form and Summer Smash and all that, we've all made friends. But there's a certain level of, you know, closeness there that, you know, I'm still lacking. I'm still missing that. Just being a happy, happier person. I mean, I'm a happy person, truly, but 
you know, there's just that little bit inside of me that, you know, keeps me from going out and doing the little things in life that, you know, most people are out there enjoying right now that are my age. My weight is holding me back. Or at least I feel like I'm holding myself back with my weight. Um, but that's what this transformation means to me. I want to continue to post videos. Um, got a new camera so I can actually do these videos a little better quality now. If anybody would like help with videos um, within this area, uh, I can easily go to St. Louis, things like that. I'm more than willing to. That is something that I want to do. That's one of the big things that will get me out of my comfort zone from where I'm at right now. And that's what this is about for me. So if anybody wants a video or anything like that, please shoot me an email, Facebook, Instagram, whatever. Um, but that's currently where I'm at right now with this transformation. I want to thank First Form for putting this up. Um, I want to thank Andy Purcello for putting himself out there. That is one thing that really made it easier um, to put myself in front of a camera now. If he can do it, why can't I? Um, I know my buddy Sean, if he can do it, why can't I? If my fiance can do it, why can't I? I mean, there's no excuse anymore. It is what it is. I've got to get my ass in gear and do this. So I'm excited to see the progress. I'm excited to show you guys my progress and I'm excited to hear you guys' stories. So let me know if I can help you. I know I'll be reaching out to a few of you, um, but thank you for your time and good luck. Thanks.